Alright, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Now, I haven't played any Conquest in a little bit of a while. I've been mostly playing Rush recently, which I've been really enjoying, and a little bit of Team Deathmatch as well, because it's a bit less hectic and crazy. But I'm going to dive into a little game of Conquest, the Sundance, see what we can do. As always, I'm using the RM68, which is absolutely ridiculously broken in my opinion. This gun is just disgustingly good. So, as always, guys, if you do enjoy, if you do enjoy the content, please do like and subscribe. I appreciate you all very, very much indeed. I'm using Sundance. I do think that she's probably a bit of an underrated specialist. She doesn't get that much use anymore from what I can tell. But she's got a really, really cool little kit set. And I do think that she's quite good in Season 4. So, diving in, see what we can do. So, let's get into it. Right then, looks like it's Flashpoint. Let us see what we can do, eh? Use caution. You might know him, but don't trust him. He's done unbelievable damage to our operational security. We've backed you from the beginning, Notepads. Remember that. Command out. In the Mav, let's go. Junk, junk, junk. Sector goal. Right then, let's see what we can do. We'll face defeat if you continue like this. You need to secure more sectors. We'll face defeat. What are you talking about? This is gonna go on for a while this match, I reckon. Why are we going this way? That's what I want to do. Is a tank coming? No? Yes? There's a Mav here. They're literally right next to me. They've just gone past on top. And they go. One of the infantry! No class! Take them out, boys. Alright then, I guess that's solid. Enemy fire team! Heading into F1, see what we can do. Question marks on if there's anyone here. Yes, there is. They're all on the hill, as usual. Oh my god, there's so many people up there. What the hell? So many campers, man. Jesus. There we go, it's got a vehicle. That's this tank's gonna take us out, man. I can't even see him. He's buggered off. Well, all the campers are gone. Oh, wait, no, there's a few here. These people are shooting the map with small firearms right now. The guy right next to us. Is there still an enemy tank here? There's sure as shit a lot of a lot of infantry. Oh my god. Not even a chance to react. Don't you just love that? Allied forces have taken sector goal. After all that good work as well. Is there an enemy here? There is an enemy something. There you go, this roof. Hostile tank, 170 meters. Oh, why the clamber animation? I just don't want it. I did not ask for this. I wanted to jump, not clamber. So fucking annoying when you try and do something that's not what you wanted. Jesus Christ. 
There's never going to be a moment where I spawn and I'm not getting shot at. I just want to spawn reasonably safely. There's about 5,000 people on this oil rig thing, as always, I bet. Who the f piss off, man? I want to live. Holding sectors. Why is there like 5,000 people down here? Whoops. That was not what I wanted to do. There we go. <laughs> That'll do it. Okay, we're clear. Well, there was like loads of people down here. What happened? It was so strange. Might as well just keep chucking this thing. Sector FL secure. All objectives are under our control. Having like character items on oh my god. Having character items on cooldown. I don't think that should be the case. Like, it should be ammo, ammo shouldn't it? Like Zane, there should be ammo. Zane is just too busted. There's so many of them camping on this fucking hill, man. 130 meters away. It's quite a strange game so far. Doing all right though. Just dealing with a shit ton of campers. Look at them all. They're rats. Literally like rats. All on the hill. Letting their team down. Oh, wow, that was field bad man moment. That's a friendly fucking. Enemy take down. That's a friendly rather than enemy. I really need to stop shooting my own team. There's loads of them over here, man. I need like a longer scope. Threat here. Why are there so many of them camping on that fucking hill? Just doesn't even make sense. Grenade, Target locked in. They just care about hill camping and not getting to points. It's so sad, man. How many hit markers do you want? How many hit markers do you want? That was actually insane. Are they invincible or something? They just took so many hits, that was ridiculous. Tango marked, 130 meters. What in the, what in the bolt? Hostile helicopter. Drop it. Where's that guy? There we go. Headshot multiplier is busted. Should not be this broken. This is a cool little engagement. Those cinematic battlefield moments, you know. Tango on my I'm the hit fire on that thing was pretty mad then. This thing, that thing, the thing. Oh, stabbed. Is this East London? Because I just got shanked. Yeah, their team are not bothered at all about playing for points, are they? Gotta love that. Gotcha. Their whole team is just on this hill. Quite literally dying on this hill. Target down. 
They wanted a hill to die on. God's sake, this gun is insane. The bullet travel time is so fast. Actually a joke. There's so many to shoot at, I don't even know which ones to shoot. <laughs> Spoil for choice, man. What a selfish team. Kind of crazy, really, isn't it? I've never quite seen anything like it. Can I get this tank? Why did I just do so much damage to it? I couldn't. There's, there's too much support, isn't there? Way too many infantry there for me to get that. <laughs> There's too many people, man. There's way too many people. Their whole fucking team is there. I need to spawn a bit further away, don't I? Here we go, Condor. Literally the whole enemy team on this fucking hill. So many damn hit markers. Throwing grenade. Enemy wow. Down. That's all I can say to that one. I tried to get a kill. Do you really not know why? The whole team is just literally on the hill. I've literally never seen anything like it, man. The entire enemy team. And literally their whole team. Just hill cap bid. It's honestly kind of amazing. I'm impressed at the selfishness. This is like the greatest show of selfishness I've ever seen. Why is this guy so angry? It's just ridiculous how I'm saying how bad their team is and he thinks I'm having a go at him. Like, what is wrong with this guy? <laughs> People really need to relax, man. It's not real life. Marking enemy helo! 170 meters! Honestly. Damn We've secured Sector Charlie. This is the weirdest match I've ever played. It's the most one-sided affair. <laughs> I 
Why would you get that angry about something that you're completely wrong about? So annoyed, man. People are so angry. No. I've just given up because they've given up. It's being silly now. Should play better, but... It is what it is. Don't you get it in? Let me down. Why does it take 10,000 years to get up from prone as well? That is something that I would change. It shouldn't take you like literally 10 years to stand up. It is kind of insane from standing to running. It takes an approximately 52,000 seconds, which is kind of insane, isn't it? I'd make it quicker. That's a kill. We're going for it. Oh my god, I shouldn't have come out here. This is the most convincing win I've ever seen in a battlefield game, potentially. We actually lost a point. An assist. Russians are low on troops and supplies. Well, this is basically a win, isn't it? Maybe I'll just shit put shit talk with this guy. I think I know you from somewhere. What an unbelievably convincing win. This is actually kind of stupid. I've never seen such a terrible enemy team in all my life. There we go, guys. That's the win. Thank you very much. Ah, <laughs> oh, classic. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. Appreciate you all very, very much indeed. As you can see, that was a crazily one-sided game with some angry people in the chat. Please do like and subscribe. I love you all very much indeed, as always, and I will see you in the next video.